This is Pat Salber with Dr. Wei Xin, and I have a really, really interesting guest who has a really, really interesting product to tell you about. It's Greg Summer, who's the founder and CEO of uh, Track. No, that's your product. Our product. Your sandstone diagnostics, right. and your product is Track. Yes. Um, and so, what are you tracking, Greg? We are tracking uh, male fertility. So our product is a consumer over-the-counter male fertility test kit that couples can use to both screen and monitor key male fer fertility parameters at home versus the current option of having to go into a doctor's office and do a, a clinical semen analysis. We've invented a device that allows them to do that from the comfort and privacy of home. Uh, so none of those dirty magazines to get the sample. <laughs> well, you still have to get the sample somehow, but there's a big advantage to, uh, you know, doing it, doing it at home versus um, the back closet of some fertility clinic. So. Um, but, you know, in general, today most men aren't getting tested until a couple is pretty far along into their fertility journey if they get tested at all. And we really want to lower those barriers, help men get tested uh, much more easier and simpler and, and take steps to improve their fertility and, and their health as well and, and improve those chances of getting pregnant. So uh, you have the advice with us um, here today. So tell me how it works and what are the parameters that TRAC is able to track? Yeah, great. So the, the device consists of an instrument that you can think of as a, a battery-powered mini centrifuge, runs on two AA batteries, and uh, disposable test cartridges. We call these things props. And they're plastic cartridges. They're for single use. The way it works is a man collects a sample. Again, this is all at home. You don't have to mail in your specimen or anything. You add a few drops into the test cartridge, load it into our instrument, and when you close the lid, we do the rest. And and we're spinning down the sample and... So it's a little portable centrifuge. It's a little portable centrifuge, yeah. Uh, it goes through a test spin. Uh, if you open it up accidentally, it'll tell you that you didn't error. But it'll go through the spin sequence, tell when it's done. And then what's happening is we're using the centrifugal force to isolate and quantify the sperm cells directly out of the sample that you put in there. So, so it actually does a sperm count. That's right. Yeah, we do sperm counts. We've also developed a test for sperm motility as well that gives you really the comprehensive information that, that you need to know about this. Do you get it with the same um, device and the same spin? Uh, yeah, that's right. Well, the, the, the tests are, are currently on, on single cartridges. Uh, our, our initial test is a sperm count test that we've done a, a lot of validation testing showing that we're as accurate as you can get in a, in a doctor's office. Okay. Yeah. That's fantastic. And, if I, and the sperm motility, is that a separate cartridge? It'll be a second cartridge, yeah. It's going to be a follow-on cartridge that... Um, works on the same principles and same instrument, yeah. Okay, so it's motility and sperm count. Anything else? Uh, at the moment, no. Those are really the key parameters that, that you need to know to be able to, to learn about your fertility status and, and take steps to make improvements. Uh, in male fertility, uh, it's basically a numbers game. So you're looking for the highest number of healthy sperm cells in your sample. That's what correlates with chances of conception, and we're able to bring that people uh, into their homes. And uh, is this ready for consumers now? Can I send somebody online or to the pharmacy to buy one? Not yet, no. We are taking the product through the FDA 510K process. So we're, we're pursuing FDA approval for it to sell it directly to consumers in an over-the-counter product offering. Yeah. And I guess the last question is, it certainly sounds more convenient and um, for some, probably an easier process to be able to do it at home as opposed to in a doctor's office. Uh, but how much is this going to cost? Have you thought about pricing yet? Yeah, we, it, we haven't finalized the pricing and it's going to depend on really where people get the product um, as well as how many tests are purchased. So the, the great thing about this product is that it allows people to monitor results over time. So there's a lot of things that men can do in their lives, you know, lifestyle, behavioral changes, things like you know, eating a little better, being a little bit more active. They've been shown to drastically impact sperm quality, and this is a way to monitor those at home. So uh, buying multiple tests, testing yourselves you know, once or twice a month to see the progress is really how we want to position it. The, the product's very simple. We plan to price it similar to what's going on on the female side in terms of ovulation monitoring and predictor kits. This is something that's uh, solely for the guys. So. OK. 
Okay, fantastic. And I understand, well, you gave a talk today, and I had the good fortune to be in it, and you made a comment that one thing that men can do, because we know that heat, is, heat affects sperm count, is they can quit taking regular hot tubs. And I understand that you have a website that has an interesting name that I presume is related to that phenomenon. You want to tell our audience how they could go to your website? Absolutely. Check us out at don'tcookyourballs.com. Uh, it's an all-inclusive, comprehensive source for information and education on male infertility. And, and heat's a big one. Hot tub use is uh, basically male contraception. Uh, you know, the, the sperm-making parts of the body are on the outside of the body for a reason. Uh, but there's all sorts of things. Um, it's been tied to uh, other medical conditions. It's uh, tied to diet, obesity. And basically what the doctors say is what's good for the heart is good for the sperm. So sperm provide a little bit of a window into men's overall health. And in general, as men get healthier, you see sperm quality go up. So the purpose of our site is to help men understand, you know, first of all, this is a pretty common medical condition. But the second of all, that there's a lot that you can do about it. And we want to we, we approach it in kind of a lighthearted tone to, to help lower those communication barriers, help people understand what's going on, and ultimately take control of the problem. Yeah. Okay, so there you go, www.dontcookyourballs.com. Did I get it right? And the product is Track, and uh, I wish you very good luck at getting FDA approval because uh, I think moving these kinds of diagnostics into the home uh, for fertility and for a whole bunch of other things is really the wave of the future. So you're riding a good wave. Congratulations, Greg. All right, thank you so much. Appreciate it. Thanks.